Hi, welcome to a Climbing Daily PLA Door Special. This is Alpinism's equivalent of the Oscars and the opening ceremony is about to get underway, so we're gonna go and check it out. The ceremony gives the nominees and the jury a chance to meet each other, as well as giving the public and media a chance to talk to some of the climbing legends. And it's all in for Grab a Mountaineer. So we've just run into US alpinist Colin Haley, who's here for the free free food or the the ceremony? Socializing, les apparatifs. So what's your take on the whole PLA door thing, the climbing as a competition? I, I don't have a really strong opinion either way. I have lots of friends who uh, are quite strongly against the concept of competition in climbing, and I don't disagree with them, but to me it's not really a big issue either way. Could you hazard a guess who might win? No, I, honestly, as always with you know comparing climbs, it's kind of apples and oranges. So we managed to find Matthias, Simon, and Hans, and we're going to ask them about their nomination. But they're having a bit too much banter. <laughs> so guys, tell us about your nomination and the line you did. Oh yeah, it's called the mountain. It's called Kunyan Chish East. It's 7,400 meters high. It's a mountain in the Karakorum Range of Pakistan. And we did the first ascent. We are the um, Southwest face. So are you you confident? You think you may win? I mean, do you care? Yeah, of course. We, really, <laughs> we are not sure about that. But Some people don't like the competition. You, you, you're wanting to win. You're all for no, the competition. It's, uh, it's nice to be here. Of, of, of course, we would like to, to get the PLA door. So I'm here with John Ross Kelly, who's receiving the Lifetime PLA door award. John, you must be very pleased. Uh, it's overwhelming, really, um, to be named uh, in the same breath with some of those climbers that you know have already got the lifetime achievement award is um, that's amazing. What are you particularly looking forward to? I think meeting uh, the other climbers that have done things that are being nominated for this year, but also some of the older climbers that are around here. Chamonix is the place where climbers have always been and always gathered. So, so we've just run into Ian Wellstead, who's been nominated for his climb on K6, K6 West. K6 K West. Yeah. Tell us about the route. It's about three kilometers above base camp. On this that we haven't done on anything else is we climb technical ground at about 6,000 meters. So there were three crux pitches that Raphael led. And yeah, we've gone on three trips together now and we we're both glad to finally make it up a big peak. We've just run into Liv Sonzos. She is in charge of the PR for the whole event. So what is the, the most difficult bit of your job or any of the climbers divas? I think this year it's a little uh, tricky because there is uh, the Ulishtek controversy. Some people started to adopt uh, Ulishtek climbs the surface of Annapurna. So there are like lots of people writing, arguing he has not climbed the surface and things like that. So it's, it's, uh, I think this is the hardest part to deal with this year. I like to see motivation of the climbers, that they uh, still to reach without um, without any doubts to follow the aim, not for money, not for uh, for material reasons, just for pleasure of yourself. So what is the most difficult bit of deciding who's going to win the PLA door? The most difficult part is the agreement between each other. <laughs> Catherine, how are you enjoying being on, on the jury? It's your first time. Yeah, it's my first time. So. I it's, uh, it was not very easy to choose. How do you choose? What is the process? You have a, a big list. We compare all the lists and then we plug all the, all the people who are in common. When will you decide? When is uh, the final decision? Uh, the final decision will be on uh, Friday. Yeah. Who, who are you going to vote for? I, I, don't, uh, I, don't, I will not tell you. <laughs> That's it from here. We'll see you on Monday when we'll be announcing the winner from the closing ceremony in Cormier. They then climbed the Kamichi line on Chima Grande and finished with the inner Kofla on Chime Pecola. In all, it took them 15 hours and 